guys, it's Lily. I hope all of you are doing well and staying safe. If you're new here, hi, hello, welcome. Thank you for joining me on this episode of The Fixer Upper. We are back with Cassidy. She is currently at work and she should be home any minute now. I just want to take a quick moment and thank everyone from the Facebook groups and Twitter for giving me so much feedback on how to make Cassidy happy because she's a snob and is proving to be so hard to please. <laughs> the work that I'm putting into this house, she is not happy with. You guys gave me a lot of ideas and suggestions that may help me with making her enjoy this house better. So when she gets home, I'm going to see if she brings home enough money so that way we could do the reno. That's Dominic. He's home alone because he doesn't have a job. So we're just waiting for Cassidy to get home to see if she brings home enough money so we can start the reno. Because I have some ideas that I want to try and implement thanks to you guys. Perfect. She is back home. She just brought home $2,425, bringing us up to $9,140. What are they up to? They just want to chat. He's welcoming her home. And look, she needs a vacation. So I'm thinking these are not just days off. Maybe we should just take a vacation, actual vacation. While she's out there stomping around acting crazy, I'm going to go into build mode and let's start updating and upgrading her house.
So that was the reno. I made some changes to the outside and please don't come for me. I do not know how to build. I do not know what I'm doing when it comes to the outside of the house. I'm not a builder, so I really struggle with this part. What I'm gonna do is search for some inspiration on what kind of siding I should put on this house because as you can see, your girl has no clue what she's doing. I have wood here, brick here, all this cement. I don't know what I'm doing with this part, so forgive me. The inside, I did some tricks and trades of some of the ones that recommended me to to hide paintings that cost more under items that I like. I also made changes to the living room color. I turned, I changed it to yellow. Forgot to change it here, so I'll have to do that the next time we go back into Reno. If you like the blue color better, let me know and I'll change it back. Oh my goodness, I forgot all out here too. <laughs> well, here was supposed to stay blue, so I will have to make this change when we go back into um, build mode again. I did update the dining table and chairs. I kept the same. This area is basically all the same. The kitchen, I did update the cabinets. And I think I am one more cabinet upgrade away to getting the ones that I want. Because the ones I want are more like this color, but they're open around. So I could put more clutter items in there. And I know someone did... Um, did recommend me putting more clutter on there. I want to save the clutter clutter for the end of the challenge because I don't want to use too much money on cluttering up the items and I could be updating, you know, her bed and couches and stuff. I also changed this to make this um, blend in more with the house. Upstairs, not that much happened. I did um, change her bed, her dresser. I like this mirror. I think I'm going to keep it unless it conflicts with what I do next. And, um, oh, I took the, the table here and I put it downstairs. This was the next upgrade. I am not feeling that it's too tiny. This couch is cute, but it's too, I think it's too big for this area because I want to put that little seating chair in there. It looks cute. I like it, but I don't know if it's for her. You guys let me know. Oh, and I also changed the fireplace color to, um, blend in with the color scheme of the living room. I'm digging this one for now, you know. It looked really nice um, with blue, but a change is good. So we still have landscaping to do. And um, again, when I come back with some inspiration on what I should color this house or paint this house, I'm going to do that as well. So it is 6.36. Let Cassidy cook a nice meal today. Because she hasn't cooked in a minute. So we'll do, let's see. How about butternut gnocchi? We'll have her do that. Um, while she's doing that, let him come over here, go to the bathroom. I think they're both fighting for the computer. And guys, I forgot to lower that again. The TV, it's just, it looks too high for me. I think I need to slide it down a little bit. But yeah, so we're going to let them get their needs up. This is going to drive me nuts. So let's not stay there. Let's put these walls down a little. So yeah, we're going to need another 3400 almost like $3,500 to get another upgrade going. I don't know if that's going to happen here because she has two more days of work, I think. Yeah, she goes to work tomorrow and then she has Wednesday off. Well, I think we should schedule a vacation. Maybe they could go to Mount Komorebe to, um, you know, just chill out do some snowboarding skiing soaking in the hot springs so we'll have them do that he can he's complaining about this dirty counter but yet he don't want to clean it is she finished with dinner i'm really liking how this um table this table is from cats and dogs i love this table it's really nice in this area and i still have um these paintings these paintings are environment 10 so i kept them the way they are this plant is environment five. This one is environment four. So I kept those in there. Goodness, you didn't even wait for him to eat. No, you're not going to cook. You're going to grab a serving. Come on, grab a serving. Then you could talk to your boo. So I'm going to let them eat dinner and then I'm going to have her do her column. So that way she's ready for work. I know some at some point I want to get them on vacation, but I just don't know when because I want that money because I really don't like the outside of the house. 
<laughs> I'm no good at this part, so forgive me. It needs a lot of help. Even with the windows, I was struggling. Like, should the windows go higher? Should they be lower? Should they be all the same kind? I am really um, digging these windows here. But I don't know how to implement them all the way around the house. So, I don't know. I'll figure it out. I know my girl Kim. She watches my videos. Please help assist out because I need help. Maybe I could upload this <laughs> to the gallery and you could fix it outside for me. So I'm going to let them finish up for the night and we'll check in with you tomorrow when she gets back from work. So while they're sleeping, Cassidy got this um, lifestyle pop up. She said that it was at risk. Single and loving it is at risk. Sims living a single and loving it lifestyle happily enjoy the single life and savor their independence. To acquire or maintain this lifestyle, avoid being in a committed romantic relationship and romantic media. Well. I'm okay with saying goodbye to this one because I think she and Dominic really like each other. I don't want to ruin that for them just because of a lifestyle. So if it has to go, it has to go. So Cassie is up and she just got back taking a jog. She just fulfilled a milestone. She just finished um, spend 10 hours doing exercising. So she got that milestone. Now she's in the fourth tier of this. And also, look what came in, $1,602 we owe. So even though she gets paid today, she's not going to have enough to do renos. Let's get Dominic to go to the bathroom. He went on his jog today too. And let him eat something as well. Let's get some leftovers. And I'll clean that up for you guys. I did have Cassidy, um, I did queue up for her to go to work. So that way we could just have her work her normal thing. We don't have to control her. Geek Kong is in town. And I'm going to have her pay these bills. I hear the festival t-shirts are out of this world. Let's go to the festival and buy one. No, Marcus. We cannot do that with you. It's so funny. Like, now that we have a boyfriend, he wants to be acting like he's single and stuff. We can't do that. Oh, we're missing work. Let's go. Bye, Cassidy. Have a good day at work. And we will let her, no, not eat at restaurants. Let her write reviews. So we are back. Cassidy has earned a raise. Cassidy has been given a raise as curator of the finest flavors for the superior work performance. She will now make an additional $11 per hour for a grand total of $496. Even though she brought home a lot of money, we are still $2,600 and what, 30, $36 away. I'm gonna let these two catch up, talk about their day, spend some time. They haven't been affectionate with each other. Enthused about her interests or his interests. Let him flirt with her. Uh, let's see her whims, actually. Look, guys, we got this decently decorated. This wall art is five environment, but I put a painting back here, which is like twelve hundred bucks, and that was like around four hundred. I mean, four environment, four or five environment. But anyway, whoever gave me that tip, thank you so much. I know it was from the Facebook group, so you guys rock. Thank you so much. And I know um, Kim. She told me to get items that have an aura. I don't think I have any. I don't think I have any items, but I'm going to definitely keep that in mind the next time I go into Reno mode. Look at Cassidy. Yes, girl. Liking. Uh oh. oh. Okay, let's see. World weary. For those with sophisticated taste, some TV channels are merely. Okay, I get it. She doesn't want this, but I do know what she likes. She likes the political. Let's see if this works for her. And her whims are nice. She got got the promotion, feeling a close connection, decently decorated, and she still has the um, world weary. I think this is the political channel. Let's see. Let's see. Let's watch news. Let's see if that works. Who's calling him? Cheyenne Jeffries wondering if I want to go. No. Bye. Sally Oh, and he was um, working out, so he was having sore muscles. I had him take a muscle relaxing soak bath, and he's enjoying this tea, and he shared joy 
from close sentiment towards someone feeling good, which is awesome. I'm going to have him put away his book. Let him analyze it first and then put it away. Guys, maybe this isn't a table. Maybe this is a bench. <laughs> is it cheating if I go in there to swap it out? No, I will do it. I will definitely. Oh, look, you guys can see the painting behind the wall art. <laughs> Yeah, but um, I'll definitely make sure to change that, upgrade it. I'd rather something bigger because this room is a nice size. I'd rather a bigger table here anyway. Let's see if that's changed her mood. Yeah, you see? Now she's classy content. Snobs appreciate television programming that doesn't rot the brain. So we will have her get her needs up. Let her take a shower. Um, Use the bathroom, take a shower. It's after seven. There's really nothing going on here. So I'm going to wrap this episode up. Please forgive me for cutting out the rental part of the outside of the house. I really didn't want you guys to bleed through that. So let me know how you feel about the color change in the living room and if I should keep that couch. Thanks so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Drop some love in the comment section below and take care of yourself and others around you. I will see you in another video soon. Bye, guys.